YouTube, it's Jess here and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got my usual weekly plan with me and my Erin Condren Vertical Neutral. Doing the week of 30th to the 6th and this week is Jessica J. Crew Plan's birthday on the 2nd. I thought I would do a special kit for her as well. I did one for uh, Andrea of Scribble Prince Co. And I will probably do a special one for Kirsten as well in December. And I thought I'd use the September Mystery Kit from Scribble Prince Co. It is the artist in New York. And well, Je Jessica loves New York, obviously. <laughs> and she loves art because she's like a total awesome artist for Scribble Prince Co. So I thought this would be the perfect kit to mark her. It's also super like, like fall, autumn. Which is perfect for uh it's getting colder here. I'm wearing a jumper. What? Um, so I thought it'd be perfect as well to be sort of seasonal. And it's just a really pretty kit that I've been wanting to use. And I just like, you know what? I'll just use it for her birthday, because why not? And there'll be plenty of leftovers for my B6 as well. Um, because I'll use a different kit for my rewind. Um Anyway, so for Andrea's birthday, I did the staggering boxes and I usually only do the boxes through the middle so I thought I could do like special weeks in staggering and then my usual weeks in through the middle. So because it's another special week, I will be attempting to stagger but I think I'm going to have to fast forward that. We shall see. I really love this bottom washi with this sort of streetscape of New York. And it's totally how it looks. It's like being in the movies when you're there. <laughs> I'm always like, what the? One, two, three. I'm always trying to like, what's what Kirsten does? She like lines it up with the bottom line. And you probably get high enough by doing that. So line it up with the bottom line. And if we have to cover boxes, we cover boxes. So, yeah, so actually that's not too hard. <laughs> I found it really hard to like count the three boxes up. I just get, kept getting confused. But actually doing them just with the bottom line works really well. So with the bottom washi, I will work our way. I might put this girl in the sidebar. Yeah. Um, what was the other boxes? Because <laughs> we got a ton of them. Although I'm into the quote box. Wait, I've got the bone wash right here. So we got a ton of these. But maybe I can do one last thing in my sidebar and have her down the bottom. So I can use the create more up here. I don't want to replace any of these. I think I might swap out this one for this one. Or swap out this one. Because I don't care as much about the clothes. So I think that's what I'll do. I'll use this one. And once again, even though I'm doing staggered, I haven't figured out. Um, I'm just thinking to my own Friday as well. I'll put in a special sticker for that, but. I didn't think this through. Anyway, <laughs> where can we have the double box? Maybe we can do the double box in the middle on the weekend. So that's what that looks like. So I won't put that there. Uh, so I think on Friday, Friday night, I think I'm going to put the pizza and coffee. And maybe we can get pizza that night. That'd be cool. <laughs> And then I might put this little, put this down here in the bottom. Uh, no, I might want to, because I don't have one there, so that will be in the middle. So, alright. So I'll put these paint tubes there. Ooh. Alrighty. Luckily I got dip nails. I got my nails redone. They're really dark purple, so you probably can't even see them. Very well, but I thought perfect for autumn. And even though it looks like nails I could have done at home, 
which I'm very aware of. Like, I have this color at home, actually, I think. Maybe less, more red and less purple. But I don't mind because, um, uh, because it's dip, it doesn't get like as messed up so easily as if it was just normal nail polish. I also haven't found it to be, um, I don't think it leaves lines at all, so that could be, that's interesting too. I just cover up these dots, these glitter headers. I think I'm going to fast forward the rest of this because I'm going to be concentrating too hard. <laughs> so I'll be right back. Still as a breeze, a river flowing deep, don't want to leave the air you breathe. Living me these dreams when I think of you and me, don't want to leave the world you see. Scanning it to make sure it's all good, but it all worked out. I just realized what drink I'm drinking out of <laughs> my New York City like Disney shot store cup. So yeah, pretty funny. So it's pretty like on point. So that is all the headers done. Yeah, a little bit less room at the top, but I think the stagger looks pretty cool. Thinking about the glitter, um, the date covers at the moment. I'm not sure. So. Let's go straight into the sidebar, and I don't think I'm going to put too much in the sidebar this week, so I'll put in the quote box down more close to the bottom here. Then maybe I'll put a glitter header. Yeah. Just to sort of set that apart. Ugh, so many things. Um, so I got my two ones, and of course it's red and navy. <laughs> we'll put the red first, then the navy. Then we'll break this up with the. Well, what color is the dinners? Oh, it is this color. So, whoop. Go back, important. So I'll put this green one back, and we'll do. Kind of tempted just to do another navy. Will that look weird. I think that looks okay. <laughs> it's glittery compared. And then we'll put the dinners down with the matching box. Kind of downplaying the yellow here just a little bit. So we got that, and then now we can see about our a la carte girl. What the trimmer off at the bottom actually? But which one? Hmm. I think I like the one wearing the white better with the painting easel. So I'm just going to put this down at the bottom and then we'll trim off the excess. Slide that right up and you just have the tiniest bit of overhang. And there we go. All done. Super quick easy sidebar. Don't really need too much in it. 
Now we really gotta decide on the date covers. We have plenty of deco here, so maybe we won't do them. Although we do have like this. So you could just wipe that out. A little asterisk to mark the new month. Maybe we'll leave Cinco de Mayo up there. Alright, so because we're going to keep that, the deck covers, I'll put in both of the flags. They're a really cool brick pattern. Put that in. So I don't have any, I haven't done any pre-planning for this week. So we're kind of going to wing it. <laughs> So we're going to see how that goes um, in terms of, I don't know, how this goes all, all together. Um, I might put some of the, the stuff to the side. Alright, I just put all my leftovers to the side to use in my B6. So got the main things is, second is... Jessica's birthday and the third is the official launch of Erin Condren new Erin new life planners which I will pick one up on the day so we can get a nice unboxing video going although I think there's a early release on the 1st of May but we'll see so I think first things first on Monday coffee Monday I have these um, Hello Petite Paper Autumn Coffee Times and I'm thinking of doing this red plan. Yeah, I think that'll look cute. So I'm going to just use my tweezers to... I already... I apologize if there's any like cuts in the filming or noises but there's something going on outside. I can't see it but it's being very loud and annoying so I'll put some noise reduction on this video as well so hopefully we can get it, like the background noise away but it's really annoying me right now I can't see it oh there it is it's a freaking lawnmower okay it's a little while later for me and just waiting waiting for that lawnmower to go away He's like super killed that lord, that lord as well. <laughs> oh well. Um, I'm trying to think like how I want to mark things in my plan. I think I want to use a bunch of fox and cactus stickers. So I just went and pulled out a bunch from my collection because I feel like they go pretty well with this spread. So copy mine. I'm just trying to think of what I want. I definitely want to put. Brooklyn Nine-Nine down the bottom. Then I'll put the navy just because I like having my TV in there. And then the first thing I want to do on Monday is get back into the gym. So I think I'm just going to use this little running girl. And for that I think I'm going to use one of these fancy labels. Well, it's a lot of yellow together. So I'll use the light teal. The teal. Trying to do as much in as possible. So I want to go to the gym. And I also want to do some research. Like that's what my main goal for the week is. I'm just going to put this little Reading fox. Look how cute that fox is. So cute. You can see the bigger version here. Ah. So do some reading because I'll be at work. Because I'll be going to the gym. And then that night, I want to um, change up the candles in my house. There's actually some that I have, but I'm going to keep a winter for when I actually change it for winter, because I do actually have winter. Um, I might just change, uh, use the cute pumpkin spice one. I realize I have one, so I'll just use that for marking changing candles. I'm using, using marshmallow fireside, but I've like almost used it up, <laughs> so I have to change it over. 
And then one of my goals for this week is to start reading Harry Potter. I borrowed the very first book from the library. Um, otherwise Jessica's going to be mad at me. And I thought the week, the week of her birth might be a good time because so I have these Ravenclaw girls from Fox and Cactus. The lawnmower is back. I thought he finished. It's all brown. Stop it. Anyway, put down this Ravenclaw girl to mark for start reading that. And sorry this has been a haul. I just realized I have to mark a haul now. <laughs> so I've got these um, Miranda classic cards from Clever Girl Crafts. And I thought this sort of teal blue matched. And I just have gold foil. I'm not bringing in a lot of foil in this kit this week. But I'll just put this here in the white space to mark that my video goes up that day. So that's a full Monday. You can see how I'm gonna try I'm gonna I'm trying to adjust my planning because I have a rewind planner. And that these are literally the things I would like to do. Yes. So we'll try and get those done. So me first I probably won't get into uni that day but I, what I want to do is request my US box and I have these Harry Potter owls from um, Fox and Cactus also an upcoming haul so I thought this would be a good one to use to mark that and I need to request that might use this navy appointment label and use a little owl on the post box to request my US box. Because I've got a ton of mail there. I'm just waiting for one more item. Um, then it is also payday from Etsy. So I'm going to just put this a little bit further down. A little payday fly that came with the kit. And then the little stack of money. I miss these. But be interesting to see what she has in her reformat. Maybe I'm whining for no reason. <laughs> um, and then I actually want to film my rewind and plan with me on Tuesday. Because, so, you know, then the whole week is done. So what do I want to do to mark filming? That's a whole other ball game. I might just use these fall um, ones from Hello Petite Paper. And I do actually use a TN, so um, which one do I want to use? Maybe this orange one with the bow. I might use this to mark my um, rewind plan with me. It's been annoying how it's got a big white line on the bottom. I'm just going to trim that just to make it a bit more a bit more nicer on that glitter header. Alrighty then. Put that in there for a rewind plan with me. Um, and then on Tuesday, then that day I also want to can get a quarter box for this. I want to meal plan and order groceries for the rest of the week. So get delivered. On Thursday, I guess. Yes. So I'm going to use one of these like cooking foxes, just like sprinkling. <laughs> uh, which thought that'd be cute to mark meal planning. So I'll remember to do groceries delivered on this day. Maybe I'll just use the groceries from this. Or, the lawnmower is coming back. Urgh. I'm going to take this and I'm going to use the, oh, I might as well use the red basket. I don't know why the basket specifically, but it's red. And when do I use red kits? So I'm going to put this here on Thursday morning, just so that's what I'm going to set for the groceries to be delivered. So that's meal planning 
I think that's all I've got planned for this day. So I'm just going to leave it at that. Then Wednesday, it of course is Jessica's birthday. So use the color label for. So I'm going to use the, oh it's about right next to this. I think she'll understand if I use this. It's right next to this one too. <laughs> Maybe I'll put this uh, later in the day. And then it's, ah, I'm going to put it in the middle. <laughs> right smack bang in the middle. Alright, then we have that one there. And I brought out these Lizzie bows from Clever Girl Crafts, so I was going to use this navy one. But now it's the navy box. Because I don't have the Miranda colorway in gold for the hot for the bows. Hmm, <laughs> that must have been nice and sparkly. I have these yellow and red bows. Maybe I'll just use the red. Ugh. I probably should have used a kit that had um. Uh, silver foil because that's way more Jessica but and then I do want to find a little foiled birthday sticker from paper blush bar the same and I think I'm going to use the cupcake for Jessica my fellow Jessica A little cupcake in there to mark her birthday. So happy birthday for Wednesday, Jessica. Ah, if you're watching this. <laughs> so I will probably mark um, Supernatural down the bottom on Wednesday. I think Black, did Black Lightning finish or, if it, or is it just on a really long break? I don't know, I gotta check up on that. It's not coming up on next episode, but we're getting Supernatural like it actually is on the Friday, like it's supposed to be Friday for us, but we didn't get to like Wednesday, so I'll put it there. And that means I can then put my video in a hole down here. Um, and then, I don't know if I have any, I'm going to go to work on Wednesday, so I'm going to take a running girl because I want to go to the gym. And I might leave some room in the middle. I got red, so I might as well do yellow. But that'll be so I'll put it there. I'm gonna make sure you know where your stickers are going. <laughs> oh, it's right next to yellow. Whatever. Whatever. I give up. But there's the gym. So it's the first half of the week. So the third is going to get groceries delivered and then we have the new Erin Condrums coming out. So we're going to use this box up here. Although it might be night time. So I'm going to put this down the very bottom to mark new Erin Condrum release. And what am I going to use for that? I have these old ones from Scribble Prince Co. I have these very specific ones from Hello Petite Paper. I have these very old scribblers. Okay, so what am I going to choose out of these three? This one seems... I think this could actually go because it's a pretty big special sticker, right? It's a pretty big event, so I might use this one down here and just put it right down the bottom in the half box. And she's holding up the Erin Condren, like, look, new Erin Condrens. All right, awesome. And then I'm also going to film this day, which I'll put up here. And I might just put in white space. And I'm thinking of using 
The blue is slightly off, but I think I will use it from Happy Daya. So I'm going to put this here to mark filming, and I'll use this film script from um, Paper Princess Plans because I love the, like the gold and her font, which is her hand handwriting. <laughs> Um, I might just look this up. Put this in afterwards. So I'll put the little film script and then I'll put the camera in. Just a little bit off. There we go. Perfect. So I'll be filming. Um, and then I'll just be editing. So maybe I will use the little munchkin on a laptop from the freebie to mark edit kind of on the film but I will and of course we have Anne Crangens at night so then we got Friday which is actually May the 4th which is May the 4th be with you so I think I will put up a quarter box to do with that because you know, Star Wars, <laughs> and I'm going to use one of these Star Wars girls from Fox and Cactus, and I think I might use a Obi-Wan kind of one <laughs> in the grey. So I might do that here, and I might put, I might put it this way. So it's Star Wars Day on May the 4th. Um, down the bottom here I want to put in another video, this is the B6, let's put that down there, just in the white space, um, and I also want to go to the gym this day, so put this here, I might put something in the middle, and then put this one like here, alright, put the gym in, um, maybe I want to go to the gym on one of these weekend days, but I don't know which one. I think that's all I'm going to put in for Friday, just it gets a little bit less being out of plan on the weekends. Uh, I do want to put the movie marquee on Saturday and I might just put it at the top of the bottom box here. It's right at the top. And then Saturday, I will put up my last video, which will be my rewind. So we can stick something in here, I think. And the rest of the weekend, what does the weekend banner even look like? I might actually put the weekend banner in this weekend. Is that weird? <laughs> I don't know, I thought that could be... Interesting to do again, maybe over the glitter headers. Wow, I haven't put the weekend banner in so long, but it's because of the white brick. I don't think it like makes too much of a mess. I think we want to do some laundry on Saturday. And to mark Cinco de Mayo. I have here on the um, Jessica's freebie. I have her this little taco and a little margarita, and maybe I will get the margarita one. Or I might save that for. I might save the margarita one for Austin <laughs> um, to mark Jessica, but I might use this taco one down here, little taco scribbler. Just to mark Cinco de Mayo down the bottom, maybe we can have some Mexican food in honor of that. We got some really good Mexican restaurants around the joint, so I might hit up one of those. Probably Holy Amigo, that's my favorite. Because you get like a container with a whole burrito and then you get like a really good flavored rice and a really good salad, so it's like more like even so I put laundry up there because I was like I should probably do laundry <laughs> um, this week I think that's all I've got planned for this week actually I think that's all I got 
Oh, I was gonna have a bath. So maybe I'll have a bath on Sunday night. I know these really cute um, bath girls from Fox Cactus. I might use the one holding a wine glass. And I'm gonna save this last fancy label in case I go to um um wherever you know in case I go to the gym and then I'm just gonna put an appointment label down the bottom here um to mark having a bath because now that it's colder I think it's easy to have a bath let's put the bath down the bottom there and I think we're actually done which is kind of nuts I know this video is probably really long and I don't even know it. So let's just zoom out here. So that is the completed spread. I'm going to put in the top deco to some music and then we will finish up. Okay, that is the finished spread. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you across the week with my other videos and talk to you next time. Bye!